greetings and salutations, YouTube. Back, as always, to play a little bit more Earthbound here. Decided to try and get to my third sanctuary. See how well this goes, probably as well as you imagine. So, yeah. Uh, actually. You know what? It's probably better I just nuke everything down as fast as possible here. I don't know. I remember those fucking mushrooms will do that. Turn around now and take care of it while, I, while I'm still, like, right here. Slingshot is why I generally hate that thing. Like, the damage output's really good, but let's face it, it just kind of sucks on accuracy. Ran boob. Fuck off, Rain Boob. This thing is just focus fire. Oh wow, uh, I was looking at the walkthrough earlier, and um, it said by the end of this I should be like in my high 20s, and uh, yeah, yeah, no, way past that, <laughs> kind of blew by the, the high 20s a while ago, alright, if I just focused, <laughs> fuck me. Well, there's no point in turning around now. At least the stupid mushroom is dead. And I really didn't mean to shoot the rainbow. Please, dude. Ah. I don't know why I'm laughing. 
laughing. Oh, fucking good. At least he woke up. That was a shitty level up. I'm just gonna say. Okay. Can I? I think I tried last time. Healing beta? Well, whatever. That's pretty lame. Having her not being confused would be really fucking useful right now. Is there anything there's a boss fight coming? That's why. Alright, let's fucking take this asshole down. Hopefully. It recommended I have a cup some cups of life noodles, so I have one. Uh, that should be adequate. It's probably not gonna be adequate. Alright, so please I have the big bottle. Nope. Okay. If you dare, fuck off. This thing's as good as mine. video I fought a fucking pile of vomit and this one I'm fighting a pile of dirt with a little sprout and eyeballs not gonna lie I think that would freak me freak me out more than the like sentient pile of vomit but that's just me I guess Ugh. sucks well she's mushroomed it's probably not a good idea to use her psychic powers because Last thing I need is her to accidentally like shoot like psychic ice like at Wang. Seriously? health this stupid thing has. Ha. It's fine if he wants to attack, attack Wang, because he's generally like a, my 
damage sponge right now. Oh goodness. Excellent. That's nice. I'm going with that's nice. I'm not entirely sure what that is in the middle of a pink pond. But I assume that's what water is feeding the village with Mr. Saturn's. Be a thoughtful. What was it, be a thoughtful and kind boy? Well. That's a good thing to hope for. Oh, they're running away now. I can just do this. But I don't really think I need the experience here. I'll probably just move on. It's one of my least favorite parts of the game. Personally, I hate dry, dry desert, or whatever the fuck they call it. I like the fact, I like it because it means I'm going to be going into Foresight, and I'm down with that. that that's fine. Foresight's cool. But can't really avoid it. Hey, she's cured. I didn't even realize that. Gosh darn. Full health. Okay. Just one thing for sure, I tend to grind up a lot of levels. Usually too many, but hey, whatever. Gets the ball rolling. I didn't give a shit, I'm just gonna keep spending all my points here. <laughs> Oh, my PP points. Uh, PP points. Uh. I don't give a shit. Just nuke them and keep moving. Getting good experience for this. I mean, I was doing that before, but shit. This is making it like a million times easier because they don't even get the chance to mushroom my Mushroom eyes. Mushroom rush. Mushroomization? I don't know. Now I'm just making up words. Good job, Jeff. Really tried. Not that I want to talk, considering my like Wang missed like three times in a row. Oh my God! It's your dad. You've been out there for some time. Yep. Sure. Whatever. Take a break. Stop calling me.
sweet. You know, I was thinking about it the other day. Ness, like I played uh, Ness in uh, Super Smash Brothers on my 3DS, and uh, I didn't really thought about it. But most of the moves you do in that are aren't things Ness can actually do. So. And I'm not even sure if I'm gonna leave the, you know, me walking back to town in, because I'm sure everyone just wants to see that. You know what? Yes. Yes, I will leave it in. Padding. It's called padding. Padding, padding, padding. Well, now that, like, I, oh, for fuck, these things still want a piece of me? I guess they are violent roaches. Are you fucking kidding? Somebody fucking kill it. Thank you. Heading back to Threed. Well, okay. Even though the maximum PP up by one is maximum PP. The maximum PP up by one is rather insignificant, I feel. I mean, I don't know. Does really one PP do? Like, I mean, in all seriousness, does that really like add anything to it? I don't really think so, considering most of the moves are kind of expensive by this point. So it's like adding one to it is. I mean, it's just not giving me anything. I'm curious about how you level up. Is it like a random, randomly, well I'm sure it's randomly generated, but I wonder like, what, like, I don't know, like what the stats are, like what the chances of getting what kind of stats and what percentage of getting like, you know, a higher amount versus that fucking one. I don't know. Minor complaint. Complaint. Or if this is like an old PC game where you gotta like save before you like level up so that way you can reload and make like take the one that generated the best stats. Probably. Shit, what am I talking about? I don't even do that now. Like in Pokemon Moon, I. I just uh, kept reloading the game when I started over uh, at the beginning. Like when you get to pick your first one, I picked, uh, oh, whatever the cat, Litten? No. Was it Litten? Yeah. Is that the name? I'm bad at remembering these things. But anyway, I just kept reloading until I got the actual one I wanted, which was Adamant, right? Yeah. So. You're welcome. Peace, love. Why don't you come back to three sometime? Sure. I really didn't think those kids could have saved the town. Who would have ever imagined it? Well, there you go, buddy. There you go.
Alrighty. in front of me. You're heroes. That rocks. Oh, does the bum even say stuff? Hmm. Dusty desert, that's what it is. I kind of missed the dark look. It looks neat, but... Oh shit. Pedo photographer! He's returned to us, as always. I mean, now there's three children, so, you know. He's gotta be on top of it now. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Bye, pedo photographer. is at peace. Aw, what's the problem? Well, that's always good. Goodness. Hmm. Should probably. Ah, there we go. Hundred and eighty dollars. Zombies vanquished. Hey, thanks, buddy. Really appreciate it. Should probably call. <gasps> what an asshole. Jesus Christ, this kid's got like $36,000 in his bank account. What a badass. Peanut cheese bars. Apparently that's what I'm looking to, to buy a couple of. And I also just read in the little in the walkthrough because um, I know there's stuff I miss uh, but it said that there's like a drawer I can go through in the hospital where I'll find something called the insignificant item and then I'm supposed to like oops and I'm supposed to give it to some disgruntled looking old dude Got the insignificant item. Alright. Then, yeah, he's just in the next room, I guess. Or not. <laughs> oh, maybe this guy. <laughs> what 
the fuck? That was strange. That was a little weird. Uh, no idea. Apparently, this guy lives in another town. He lives in Tucson. So, yeah. Oh, well then who sells the uh, cheese thing? Figure the break bakery would. It's <laughs> well, whatever. I guess I'll head back to Tucson to deliver the item, the insignificant item, to the old man. partially obscured. Well, uh, drugstore maybe? Ooh, the pizza place. They must have these cheese roll things. They better. What a waste of a dollar. <sighs> Fine, whatever. I'm just gonna go head on back to Tucson. being with the Runaway 5, but it'll do. I'll edit the, the trip back, because, yeah, I'm sure nobody wants to really watch that. I'll leave it in. curious. I want to know why this old man has the insignificant item and what it means to him. There has to be more to it. Probably not. Probably not. What, is Chaos Theater not have anything else going on for them? The Runaway 5 was just it? What a shitty venue. He's gotta be in one of the room, rooms upstairs. There he is. 
<laughs> Maybe I could give it to him. <laughs> After my life, this is the second most important thing to me. Huh. Well. That's a whole lot of pee pee. Very, very mature thing to do. Pee pee, like pee, get it? I'm gonna take a bus on back to Threed, and then we'll hop on the bus to Foreside. We'll, we'll totally make it there. I guarantee it. <laughs> Just like backs in. bus line that runs between the two towns, or well, the three towns, the on it gets no, no bus line, that's, hey yeah, why doesn't on it get a bus line, on it was arguably, like, more crowded than Tucson was, whatever, don't bring logic into this, drove across that, he didn't really care. Oh. No. Keep going. Fuck it. To Foreside! So wait, I only had to pay the $6 and I got to ride all the way to Foreside? That's not so bad. Still wondering what that says. It says something, something bus. Greyhound? Greyhound? Uh, get back on the bus. No! Please tell me she'll buy the fucking magnum. Uh, 
I'm good, thanks. Cool. Alright. I can finally get a new fucking weapon. Yes. Apparently I need to get some more fucking money. Thirty thousand, which is why I pulled out, you know, like three thousand. Well, everybody, I suppose this is as good a time as any to call it a day. Because if I don't, then this is going to be a really long video, because the whole desert sequence is really, really long. So, it's probably for the better that I just break it here, and then we'll pick back up. Uh, we'll pick back up right where we left off. And attempt to navigate this fucking desert. Ugh, this is one of the parts I always hated because everyone gets heat stroke really easy. And it's just gonna kinda suck. But that's okay. I got a skip sandwich. I'll probably buy one more before I start. And that should help me get through this pretty quick, hopefully. So, anyway, until next time, everybody. Take it easy, and uh, I'll see you next time.